This game is tea and is not suitable for kids. <laughs> Don't let your kids watch it! Hey there, honey! Also, did I mention this game has amazing music? It really does. And it's another masterpiece by Rareware. Yeah, the graphics are dated, but who cares? This was the first-person shooter multiplayer game of, like, the 20th century. <laughs> Starring James Bond. Look at those crisp gra gra graphics. Natalia Simonida. <laughs> and Trevelin. It also has a Janice and Zia, whatever. And Oromo! Yes! <laughs> Boris. Oh, boy. And Valentine. <laughs> oh, and Michigan, my favorite. Who doesn't love Michigan? Okay, that's the how to play. All right, oh, we can start a new file. Let's go. Thanks for joining in, Eddie, and have a great night. Oh, we don't, we can't even play multiplayer, yeah, because we only have one controller set in. All right, we're going to the dam first. O M O H M S S mission one. Arkolov. I can't. It's Russian, I think. Part I. Damn. Difficulty. Um. We're we're just an agent. I'm not very good at this game. All right, Bond. <laughs> Your primary objective is to bungee jump from the platform. Okay. Background. M16 has confirmed the existence of a secret chemical warfare facility at the. I can't even pronounce that. Damn. In USSR, its heavily guarded location and workings are a cause for major concern. Nerve gas produced there has been turning up in the hands of hostile regimes around the world, and deals with international terrorists have been rumored. This facility should be destroyed of extreme prejudice. Well, obviously, we hate terrorists around here. The area around the dam is well defended against a full-scale military attack, but a lone agent stands a much better chance. The easiest way to gain entrance to the weapons factory will be to get down the face of the dam. Q had an idea about that. Ah, information concerning shipping and contacts is stored in a computer system in a secret ops room within the dam. With the covert uh, modem connected to their satellite link, we can intercept the day uh, when a backup is being carried out. As for getting down the dam, use the bungee rope. At the bottom of the jump, use uh, the uh, piton gun. Simple. This is literally sounding like the opening of Spy Fox 3, where you're at the Scottish dam and you bungee jump into the men's room and then uh, rocket-powered origami skateboard your way down. I'm sure that that's just a reference to James Bond, but hey, a, a guy can dream, can't he? Anyways, we are playing my 007 Twitch. Learn it, know it, do it. All right. Uh, Money Penny, hardly a lover's leap, James. Be careful, though. I'd hate to think of you falling for anyone else. All right, don't worry. I'm sure that'll definitely happen. Let's start. Okay, Bueller Murdem in the USSR, nine years ago. <laughs> no one will notice a thing, Bond. Oh good, we have a PP7. Thank goodness, all right. Let's so familiarize ourselves with the controls. We got strafing. Oh, don't worry, guys. It's a silenced PP-7, so nobody will hear us. Oh, yes, we got the Soviet gun. A.K.A. the Prismacolor gun. Or the pencil gun. Oh, this is gonna be great! Oh, headshot! Got him! I think they're up here. Aha! Picked up some ammo. That guy certainly wasn't expecting Bond! Controls are a bit janky, it's true. But you know, considering there were like no first person shooters at the time, it's pretty fantastic. There we go. We got a sniper. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, so that's the Prismacolor pencil gun. And this is the sniper rifle. Can we shoot? Okay, maybe that's just like a hey, this is what they had. Who's shooting at me? 
Oh, there's a guard in here. Is, wait, is there? Wait, there's someone behind me. <laughs> hey, where did you come from? See you later. Maybe there are more guards that spawn in <laughs> as you go in. <laughs> Whoops. I love how when people are shooting at me from far away, my instinct is to turn around and run towards them to shoot them instead of just trying to make a tactif tactful uh, retreat. <laughs> All right. Oh, thank goodness I can see the color of the bullets as they fly by. Excuse me, sir. You need to die. I'm a secret agent so that I don't die to a single round of gunfire. Dare! Oh no! Who dares to who dares to take on Bond? Why am I suddenly surrounded by crates? I was not surrounded by crates like literally two seconds ago. Oh! That's a brutal way to go. Shot in the crotch and then in the head, in that order. Oof, I don't even want to think about that. Oh, we should definitely shoot those. From a safe distance away, of course. <laughs> oh, oh, are we going to drive the garbage truck in? That seems like a pretty swell idea. Or maybe we have to... Oh, never mind. <laughs> J Bond, or James, have you tried, you know, pushing the button? What did I say? Security gate is uh, closing, please. Oh, I see. Is there someone driving that uh, garbage truck? Or that garbage truck is driving itself? Hey, I want to ride. Excuse me, I want to drive. Let me in. Open the dang door. Who is in that truck? You get spotted by one guard, and they raise the alarm on the place. That guy was not... The alarm is going off, and that guy was, like, looking at a wall instead of, you know, out in the main room. Oh, he tried to roll. I wish I could. I wish I could. I actually am running a little bit low on health here. I could go for some body armor. I thought that was going to open the door. It didn't. Oh, wait. But now the door opened? Okay. That's, uh, that's weird. I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm just shooting people. <laughs> that's the arty way. This door is locked. Well, how about I shoot the lock? Boom. Oh, I'm so, I'm such a genius. I should be a real secret agent. No, I shouldn't. Nice graphics. All right, when do I bungee jump off of the dam and go into the men's room? That's probably the end of the level, because the second level is facility, I think. And that's where the men's room is. Yoo-hoo, is anyone here? Oh, hey, dude. Don't sound the alarm on me. You got a super promise, bro. These guards suck. Look, I am not good at this game, by the way. <laughs> but I'm still effortlessly killing them. That's a problem. If you're bad at a game, but you're still like effortlessly dispatching the enemies... Well, I'm also playing on the easiest difficulty, to be fair. The dam has definitely seen cleaner waters. Why is the water all green?
Excuse me. So that's gate number three. Hey, dude. Dang, that guy did a sick dodge. Then he, uh, he tried to blow me up. I just can run through explosions. I'm invincible. Until I needed more in, more health. All right, where, are, where are the rest of the guards? Oh, hey, guards! Hive guys! Sorry, but uh, little Timmy needs uh, Christmas this year. So I, I gotta do this for the money. Is someone chasing me? If someone tries chasing me, they're going to regret it. That's what I thought. Hey! This time you're gonna die for real. Man, how far does this damn go? I think I'm lost. Yeah, because that's the way I came from. I guess I can keep going through the interior of the dam. It's probably what you have to do. Oh, or we could climb up these watchtowers. Maybe there's some. Maybe there's a clue inside. There's not a clue inside. I already killed everybody. Ahem. Sorry. <laughs> James Bond is. Tr uh, he's a little trigger happy today. By that I mean a lot trigger happy. He's killed like literally everyone in his path. Soviet's too good, man. And these guys cannot aim at all. So it seems like auto aim is turned on for me. Ouch! Where'd he go? Okay, now that is the way I came from. I just missed a guard or one ex an extra one respawned. Ah, here we go. Oh, this looks promising. Hey, dudes! No. Okay, that guy got a shot on me. The rest are just kind of stood there and took their lumps. Like, come on, guys. I know you're the USSR, but, like, really. Expect it better. Can't, uh, convert modem not installed. Data... You cannot be intercepted. Okay. I don't know what that means. What's my next... Mission status incomplete. Okay. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to figure out what my status is. Mission objective bungee jump from the platform. From where? Did I reach the end of the level before I was supposed to? I don't have a bungee jump cable or anywhere. I feel like there would be like a red circle somewhere. Be like, hey, this is where you bungee jump from. It's the first level, so we're gonna hold your hand a little bit. There's got to be a platform out here somewhere that we bungee jump from, then. We're also, again, uh, we're pretty low on health. Oh, we also do have a sniper rifle. I gotta, I gotta remember that. Oh, well, when did we get the Donovan? Or the Dostable? Oh, maybe this platform? <laughs> wow, the ladders in this game are really picky about what is and is not on the ladder.
can't even jump in this game, so... Hmm. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, this is it. This is it, for sure. I'm gonna assume this is automated. Because I am not doing anything right now. Okay, yeah, this is... This is just like in Spy Fox. Okay, we don't need to see the slow motion replay like five times, though. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, that was it? What was the purpose of the interior of the dam, then, with all the guys? Was that just like a, ha, <laughs> you stupid, you went inside the dam? <laughs> oh. That was way easier than I made it. <laughs> I overcomplicated that something serious. Guys, I've never played the single-player campaign in 007 Goldeneye before. Only the multiplayer, so... Oh well, how's it going, Dexter? <laughs> I'm not stinky. I just applied cologne today. <laughs> Alright, weapon of... <laughs> Big surprise! Your weapon of choice was the KF-7 Soviet! It is, like, just the best gun. Cool, primary objectives. Oh, yes! Facility! <laughs> My favorite level! Getting a tree to the lab laboratory area at Rendezvous of 006. Destroy all tanks in the bottling room and minimize scientist casualties. I'm gonna kill all the scientists. Inside the chemical weapons facility, you should quickly and efficiently proceed with the bottling area and place demolition charges on the main gas tanks. Political considerations demand that collateral damage is minimized on this mission. Non-military personnel should be disregarded. Okay, fine. We'll be working with 006 on this assignment. The bottling room is the rendezvous point. Don't forget to contact our double agent scientist before you leave and warn him to get out. He will provide you with a decoder for the final security door. There are no women or casinos for a thousand miles, 007, so even you will be able to concentrate on this mission. <laughs> Alright, now listen carefully, Bond. These bombs will be armed as soon as the last one is set. Don't be too close when you set them off or you'll go up in flames as well. And while you're at it, please try and bring back that door opener undamaged for once. Too much rough handling like the last mission, and it might go wrong at a bad time. Honestly, 007, sometimes I think you damage your equipment on purpose. Hey! I get the job done! Money Penny, these chemicals should prove to be a match even for your pheromones, James. Don't take too many risks. I know the facility. I at least know part of the facility. The part where the actual multiplayer level. Chemical war Warfare Facility number two. So this is actually inside the dam, then. Yes! Okay, cool. I know this area. So we start inside the ventilation shaft. Just like a multiplayer. <gasps> oh. Okay, we go here in the bathroom. Yes, the best room in the entire game, the bathroom. Nobody heard that. I used the silenced PP7. Oh, hey, we got a Soviet. Uh, until I get more ammo for that, though. <laughs> I opened the door on this guy. He's just like, ah, oh, yeah, there's probably nothing. What a goon. He didn't even, he, he still had his pants on when he was in the bathroom. Are you using the toilet or aren't you? I kick and open all the stalls. Oh, that guy was actually, I think, wiping at the time. Whoops. Look, I gotta get his Soviet ammo. The Soviet's too good of a gun to pass up. Oh, where did you come from? It's okay, guys. I used the silencer. I used the silenced PP7, so nobody heard any of this. <laughs> That's not the open door button. All right, all right. I know. Th I know this area. They're not normally boxes there. Mmm, yes, more Soviet animals. More! Oh, hi! Hi, guys! Happy birthday to me! I'm going on a killing spree! I hope you don't take it personally! It's just for the mission! Oh, also, I need- I really need to make sure I don't kill any scientists. I haven't even been paying attention to the fact that if they're scientists or not. I assume scientists will be wearing lab coats. These guys are wearing, like, military outfits, so... You know, if you're a scientist and you're wearing a military outfit with a gun, you can't be surprised when I take you out. What do you mean the door is locked? There's normally a ZMIG in there. Or a ZMG. I always call it the ZMIG. <laughs> I don't care about doing the mission quickly and efficiently. I just want to kill Soviets. <laughs> Down with the communists! <laughs> 
I already went this way, based on the bullet holes in the door. <laughs> Is locked too? You gotta find a key somewhere. Maybe it's on one of the corpses that I shot. Could be. Maybe, do I have to shoot open the boxes? I don't think I should. I'll just look around for a key. So that door is definitely locked. Okay, cardboard boxes just blow up completely. Because why not? To quote Doofenshmirtz, why does everything blow up so easily? <laughs> Maybe there's a key card in here somewhere. <gasps> Oops! James, are you literally just like shooting? glass bottles with chemicals in them in a nuclear, like, chemical weapons facility? Um, uh, possibly. This 007 is just so trigger happy. But how about that music, though? This music is fantastic. Maybe there's more stuff on the second floor. Okay, what is my current mission? Gain entry to the laboratory area. Okay. I don't have that yet. The laboratory area is, uh... Behind... Not that locked door. It's behind... Oh. Body armor! That's nice. Okay, maybe the key's just lying out on a box somewhere. Wait, is this a case of you literally just use the key card down here? Oh no, we gotta f okay, we have to find the key card. Sorry folks, I'm really bad at this game. All the people who've actually played the single player campaign and like no oh it's maybe on the bulletin board. It's probably not on the bulletin board. I don't just like have a key card on me, do I? No, I don't. I don't. I had to check though. Maybe there's something in the bathroom that I missed. I don't even have to worry about entering the bathroom and there being proximity mines everywhere because it's not multiplayer. You were not in the bathroom when I was here originally. See, I didn't... Guys, aren't you proud of me? I didn't kill the scientist. No, it's probably just like... Yeah, you're not supposed to, but... Alright, the guy's following me. Even though I, like, aimed a Soviet pencil gun at him, he's just like, ah, blah, blah, blah. I want to follow you. Oh, well, hi, guys! Hail the conquering hero! Let the scientists escape. That's fine. I'm sure they won't tell their friends about this at all. Okay, if these scientists die because of the, uh, the Soviets, that's not my fault. Bonk, time to leave, Dr. O Do Dr. Doke. You'll need the decoder to open the bottle in room door. Good luck, 007. Oh, he's, he's on my side? He knows who I am? Wait, so the scientists are, like, the good guys? Then why are they working for the Soviets? I guess technically America worked with, the, not for, but with the Soviets in World War II. It was literally a case of the lesser of two evils. Hey, look, I don't want to shoot you, but if you don't get out of my way so I can grab that paper, I might make an exception. Relax. short this guy is. Hi-cha! 
So am I just not allowed to kill the scientists, or am I not allowed to hurt the scientists at all? Like, could I give them, like, a samurai slap to the face? Okay, what else do I have to do right now? So, my current mission... Oh, I still haven't even gotten to the laboratory area. Oh, I thought this was the lab area. Okay, folks! We're going to the part of the uh, level that's normally uh, closed off in multiplayer. So from here on out, the rest of the facility beyond this room will be blind. Because normally that... Oh, hi! The rest of this level will be blind. <laughs> hey, dude! I don't know if you know this, but, uh... You're not on the winning side of this war. Are we in the middle of a war, or is this just, like, a... A one-off thing that we're worried about? Like, oh no! The Soviets can't be allowed to have chemical weapons! Only we can have chemical weapons! Dude, I, I very much am a little afraid that uh, I'm going to be shooting at these guys and then, like, a bullet's going to hit a scientist that's hiding behind them. It's, oh, Bond, you blatantly shot the scientist. I'm like, it was his fault. <laughs> you should not be hanging out near the Soviets. I can, I can see why they cut off the map. Hey, dude. idea how much ammo I have. So much. Okay, scientists, clear the room. Now, where, where's 006? Where is he? I'll shoot you in the head, I will. I'm glad all of the scientists are wearing lab coats, being very stereotypical. Makes it very easy for me. Hello. I'm not gonna shoot you, you doofus. I fail the mission if I do. If I wouldn't fail the mission if I shot you, I would definitely shoot you, though. <laughs> Why are they running? I haven't done anything wrong. The very model of a modern major general. Okay, this, this definitely looks like the laboratory. Oh, hey! It's the main villain! But you can make it 007. For England, James. Okay. Objective 8 appear for England, Alec. It was too easy, Alec. Half of everything is luck. And the other half? Fate. Hey! Yay! <laughs> I killed him. I didn't fail the mission, did I? Oh no, it's a war move! I'm not ready for war move yet. Kill him first. Oh, I'm actually, I am actually definitely low on health here. Maybe I should take out the cannon fodder first. They're all shooting at me. Oh no, war move is definitely uh, out of blood. Gotta love the slowdown. Oh, this is bad. This is actually this is really bad. This is really bad. I should probably make a tactical retreat. Oh no, the guards are everywhere. Oh, I'm, I'm so dead. I am so dead. Maybe I shouldn't have killed 006. <laughs> this would be a bad move. Okay, okay. We don't, we don't need to see this five times in replay. Like, wow, you really stink. You died on the second level. Okay. Okay, we, we were killed in the action. We did rendezvous here. Oh, we oh we needed to destroy all the tech. Whoops. <laughs> we might have been at the very end of that level. Whoops. Oh, well. <laughs> I guess that's going to do it for 007 Goldeneye. We end with... Oh, my God. <laughs> we're going to end the game with uh, <laughs> us finishing the second mission. <laughs> But to be fair, we killed Trevelin, who's the main villain of the game. I do know he's the main villain. So, technically speaking, we still saved him.
you know, eye for an eye and all that. It was, it was, it was a worthwhile cause, I do declare. <laughs> all right, well, yeah, that it, that's it's double seven golden eye for N64. Single player mode is interesting, but the multiplayer is really where it is at. <laughs> so if if you if you grew up with this game and you have friends who grew up with this game, you know firsthand how the multiplayer is. If you did not grow up with this game, you're probably gonna hate this game because its controls are really dated. <laughs> but it's it's a it's very fun. 